two, one, go! Okay. All right, let's sink. Hey, look, have a lamp. <laughs> I got a mirror. And you could send me some bombs. That'd be nice. I mean, I'm oh, going, the... I'm going Castle Star. So. Okay. So if you could send me a weapon, that would be great. Well, I'll have plenty oh, of checks look, over here. Hey, look, an eight pack of bombs. I have a weapon. <laughs> Tree pull is more bombs. I have all of the bombs. I wish I could send you some of them. <laughs> that would be great. Uh, crab pull is trash. Have some money to buy bombs. Yeah, bombs at Lumberjack. Oh, and thanks for the armor. Yeah, armor. Armor's useful. Okay, into Hyrule Castle I go. Alright. So, I don't think we're going to do too much the commentary thing here, but um, but yeah, for the person that's watching this, right? So this is a multi-world. Our games are linked together. Um, I could find... Lo of the internet. Yep. I could find my items in his game and vice versa. Like right there, I just found bombs for Levon. You uh, could have waited a little second for that. Until I'd use some of this, all these bombs that I already have. Oh. <laughs> yeah, see, I'm not looking at a stream. Like, if we did this live, I'd be able to see, like, what he's doing more easily. And we'd be able to, like, coordinate, potentially, our setups. Like, if he needs bombs, I might go reach for bombs. But if both of us have bombs, we may start skipping bombs. But you don't know what the item, who the item is for. Until you Don't actually loot it. Until you pick it up, it'll be like, well, you, you like if you find a lamp, you'll know it's mine. Yeah, exactly. Because or if you I find, already have a lamp. Or, in this case, my my mirror would be the same way. Yep. We're we're also using uh, Emo Tracker as our tracker, which we could also use during the the event. And I forgot to get bombs. I'm bad. All right. Good job. Well, man, hey, look. just uh, send in a oh, whole geez. bunch of stuff. Yeah, stuff. exactly. Yeah. I guess I'm not bombing things. Yeah. I got all the things. So that's Hammer, uh. I got the powder. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's gonna. That's gonna be nice. Okay, so I've already found a Hyrule Castle map. I haven't found the small key yet. Who got oh, a sword? They gave him a weapon. I'm just finding yeah, all yeah. this stuff today. What the heck? Well, with a sword, do I want to do dark cross? Not really. <laughs> At least <laughs> I've got red mail now. Yep, you sure do. Yeah, I'm gonna go take these 50 rupees that I acquired and buy some bombs. Oh, look, a moon pearl. I can go into the dark world. <laughs> wow. Uh, just sub five minute dark world access. Yeah. You know. Thanks. Yeah. Which means that I'm he's going to have. <laughs> I'm going to go Sorry. check these uh, these items in the back of escape and then go into the dark. Really go to Kakariko and dark world. You know, There's... like yeah, you there... do. <laughs> just, just casually. Just... Do the super cack checks. There's the small key. God damn it. Oh, there's still an item in the dark cross, which is annoying, but I don't feel like dealing with that with three hearts. Oh, now I find bombs. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I sent you bombs. Oh, yeah, you sent me bombs. Uh, what do we got for? Lovely. Eastern and Desert or Pendants. Oh, there's your uh, Titans. Sheesh. 
Okay, okay. So, so this is actually kind of... So the progression is like a bit lopsided right now, right? Just so, a little bit. At, le at least you still have plenty of stuff to go do. Exactly. Oh, jeez, um, there's an ice rod on Lumberjacks. Yeah, well... I'm move this timer down, actually. I'm messing with my layout in the middle of this to put ice rod on Lumberjack as a thing that I might care about. It was even my 20. Awesome. <laughs> there you go. Have some love. Much love. Yeah, I'm a four hearts red male. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm sitting here on three hearts and green mail with all of the weaponry I could almost ever want. So we'll go ahead and figure out what's at library. This may not be okay. accessible for a while. But with it's any bombs. luck, I'm about to send you a bunch of items. That would be nice. Well, there's one. That's mine. So, he's sending me a bunch of items right now, which means my bomb, if I... Hopeful... I'm, no, I'm sending you a bunch of arrows right now. <laughs> so, something that can happen, right, is you can drop a bomb to try to throw it at the door to save time. But, if you receive... You get stuck in the receiving animation. And that bomb fuse does not... That timer still goes when you're receiving an item. So... <laughs> Don't die because of it. Yeah. Well, the blind check paid off. We'll see who these are for. And they're... Guys, oh, thanks. More yeah. prog of course there's more progression for me. I don't need any more progression, Senek. I have enough to do. Yeah. I'm just going to send you more arrows. You know. So I'm gonna map, check my map here, and it looks like we have a six, the six crystal. I have crystals in the light world, and my five six is pod or uh, eastern. I'll update that on Emo Tracker in a bit. So we're using Emo Tracker's auto updater or auto tracking feature, which is pretty nice. Um, the only thing it won't do though is it won't ch it won't uh, indicate your pendants and crystals automatically. So you have to do that manually. Which isn't that bad, but it's just something to, that I'll have to something do at to some keep point. keep in mind. Yep. There's more bombs. I might be doing a, a bomb mini mold run. We'll go ahead and spaghetti that up. <laughs> got my active flute. I, got, I, I have powder and mushroom already, too. So I can check magic bat. Like, I can do so much stuff. So many things are open. It's actually kind of annoying. So, so I think I'm going to go do race game. And, like, check library to race game. And then flute into, and then go to Dark World, go to Thieves Town. We're dungeon diving at minute ten. Not the best mini Moldworm cave, but it'll it'll do. We're gonna go ahead and send a bunch of stuff to maybe Lavon. Hopefully not. Just uh, I still got my silvers and some health for some people. And my and I got the Fisher Price shield. Thanks for the lag. So, 
if you're playing randomizer just casually, this is actually kind of a, a somewhat dangerous area of the game early on. These crabs do two hearts of health. Health hearts of damage. You're gonna uh, you just gotta be a little careful. Easy to dodge, but you just gotta do it. So should I go in? Should I should I go into dark world or should I go just keep doing light world stuff? What do you think? Um, really, it's about density, right? Yeah, so... density is probably actually light world still because I haven't done I haven't done many mold arms and all that stuff. Yeah. So yeah, I'll I'll be nice and I'll try to find you find you your progression. This is totally not a race. But you could race it. But you could. Yes. It, racing this right now is it is popular just because of kind of the nature that it's in right now. But eventually, racing multi worlds is, is going to be a thing. Right now, isn't like the difficulty with generation. Yeah. Or so. Racing? It's mostly related to, uh, you could run into technical issues early in the run, and nothing would feel more bad than losing a race because of, of tech issues early in. So we had some yeah. luck here. We were getting each other's items, but sometimes that doesn't happen for whatever reason. It's pretty rare nowadays. Well, it's, it's rare now because people know actually know how to set the thing up. I think that was a lot of it at the beginning, as people were mucking up the setup. Mm -hmm. Which, so. I mean, is understandable. Brand new clients and brand new things. Yeah. If you want to check this out for yourself, uh, you can go to the main... Huh. This might make this Eastern Palace dip a little more unnecessary, but I'm going to do it anyway. I don't have the bow, so I can't finish this dungeon, but... I don't have enough money to do Zora, sadly, otherwise I'd go do Zora. I'm still going to go over there and do that area, but... Yeah. So I'm still looking for my Moon Pearl. Levon has his. Have I have... I have so much stuff. Exactly. It's and you're, kind you're, of not fair. Yeah, you're going to run into this, right? Because, like, unless I find more progression soon, I'm going to end up what's known as BK mode. Um, that's where I am out of checks. It originated from the Uter community. Um, wasn't it Spike? I think it was Spike. Said it. What am I doing? Anyway. Um, I'm going to go to Burger King now. Here we are. I'd like to have a weapon. Just anything. You have bombs. Barely counts. Bombs are weapons. Bombs are weapons. You can kill a lot of things with bombs. You could go yeah. do castles. You, you could go, go do escape. Technically, escape is in logic with... If you have access you to bombs, which have, you do. You even have a lamp. That's true. I can check the back half of Escape. That might be a good play after this. I'm already yeah. kind of... <laughs> forget about Escape and then... I've got a little note. There is an item in the Dark Cross. It's the dark part of Escape. The mirror can be found in Sanctuary. Thanks, game. Appreciate it. Oh, hints. Yes. So, yeah, there are hints. There are uh, 17 tiles in the game. 15 have hints in them. There's also, I think, five or so storytellers that will also provide hints. That's a multi-world only thing. Multi and entrance do that. Yep. You should send me 309 rupees right now. Exactly I'll do my best. No more, no less. Well, at least with this boomerang, I can do some enemy control. Okay, well, 
There's nothing in Zora's area unless it's on Zora. So we're not getting that for a minute. Into the dark world. I mean, there's some health. <laughs> so, I'm kind of done there. I don't have bow. I just kind of just dipped it, thinking, you know, I'm already on the way. I, I'm low on progression items. I'm going to have to go back there at some point because it is a crystal. Um, but it is what it is. So, I'm going to go do that back half of the escape here. This just requires a bomb for the doorway right here. Okay, hype cave. Hey look, my master sword. I'm winding up with all of the progression, I'm sorry. Oh look, a shovel. So I'm in the dark world, I can't do that here. So we're gonna have to go ahead and uh, kill a key rat. Don't have a proper weapon, so let's just. I got, but I got three bombs. That's all we need, right? Yeah, there we go. I picked the right one. So yeah. my pet key rat is a pendant in my game, so I might not need that ice rod. And the odds are good right now because all of my light worlds are light world dungeons are crystals. Dark cross. It was a bust. Now, I I could go to Death Mountain right now, and I've got all the gear. I could get into. You could get into Hera. I could get into Hera. Uh, I won't won't be able to get very far. At least I won't be able to kill, um, I will be unable to kill Moldorm 1 without, uh, without a sword or a hammer. I'm going to keep digging in this digging game, even though I already have the item, because I need money. <laughs> it's a legit strategy. You can also just hit up the archery game. No. <laughs> archery game isn't that bad. No, you never do the archery game. You're not that desperate for rupees right now. You'll find them. I did it once to get archery game money, the, or um, digging game, game money. money. Yeah, that's not actually not a bad place to to get digging game money at least. It's just twenty rupees. There's a nice setup for it. Yeah. You probably won't see it this game. No. You definitely won't see the archer in this game. Alright, here's 50 bucks for you. Okay, awesome. Cabbages, please. <laughs> I don't think I've sent you a single item. Like, useful item. Or no, I sent you no. gloves. Yeah, you did send me gloves. Oh, there's a moon pearl on Spec Rock. I wonder who that's for. I wonder who that's for. Okay. Now I don't feel too bad. I'm going to go clear Thieves Town. Now, there is a hint here. I'm going to be a bad multi-world player and skip it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go. I'm going to start dungeon diving. I guess we'll see what, what Hera has, and then almost talked to the blue guy. Or to the, Don't talk to the blue the guy. Kirby. Don't talk to the Kirby. Yeah, he has an obnoxiously long amount of text. That is the same also in the vanilla game, but it's just more annoying because most of the text is actually removed, except that guy. Yep. He'll just, uh... The randomizer developers are great. They removed a lot of the text mashing. It's it, it's wonderful. It's really hard to go back from like rando running 
to playing NMG or like anything with the vanilla game. So I was being bad and I picked up that map. Big, the big chest in Ganon's Tower contains a small key to Ganon's Tower. Oh, I that's guess. useless. Yeah. Alright. We can put off. Depending on what we find in here, we might be able to put off, uh, well, I don't have magic. I have two bombs. This might be a really fast trip. <laughs> like, I'm actually almost appropriately geared for the place I am right now. I'm in Thieves Town with six hearts and blue mail. And a Master Sword. Pots. They're the strongest weapon in Hyrule. Or close to it. <laughs> Let's go check this hint tile. The big chest in Ganon's Tower contains a map to Ganon's Tower. That's not a thing I want. Magic Bat leads to 300 rupees for you. Well, at that point, I won't need 300 rupees. So, so I have one more item left in here. If this big chest has an item, then I'm done. Otherwise, it could be on Moldorm 2, which I can't kill yet. <laughs> yep. So, that's a key. So... <laughs> Gonna go do a uh, tile room? Yeah, I don't even know if it's required or not. But, you know what? Let's do it. You're here. Yeah. <laughs> You're here, and I'm delving dungeons. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't... Well, the thing though is, right, I picked up that Moon Pearl, so I actually have a lot of stuff available to me here really soon. You just need the other piece of your Dark World access, don't you? Uh, I've got Titans. Oh, you have Titans? Oh, so you can, yeah, you yeah. can go everywhere now, pretty much. Yeah, this may not have been the play to make, but it's the play we deserved. There you go. There's a piece of progression for you. It's even the it's the better boomerang. No, the worst boomerang. Don't don't let Clifford fool you with his better boomerang shenanigans. Uh, so Moldarm does have an item. That's good to know. All right, so I'm done up here. Let's go to the dark. Yeah, so on the Fane Discord, uh, I uh, I have the boomerangs as sprites. Should it's, I do uh, LSD blind? I'd, do, I'd show it off. I'm not sure if I can actually get it without the boots. But I'll try. Yeah, on the main randomizer Discord, uh, oh, the, yeah. the, the red boomerang is worse boomerang as the emote. Oh shit! <laughs> you know what I? You know what? You know what I did when I did LSD blind? Messed up the scripted fight. Go have fun. You have all the gear, right? You're good. Everything's fine. This is fine. This is totally the way the fight is supposed to go. So. <laughs> I was now... standing too far, too far north in the room. There's, have some health if you need it. Send him a... a... So... Don't have a proper weapon. I've got Verna. With a full magic bar, that might be enough, I think. Maybe. Maybe not. 
Okay, well, I'm gonna go. Do, I'm gonna do Smith. I'm gonna do Smith Chain. That's a good check. Well, I'm just gonna I mean, put off. To, Sorry, go ahead. I have to save and quit it, which sucks. But... While I'm at it, I'll do dig. Do the dig spot. I think I'm going to do something similar. I think I'm going to take the frog for a tour. Well, first we got to... So I can't have the frog follow me yet. Um, the reason why is... Hey, look, more progression for me. I have a hook shot. <laughs> so now I have a bunch of Death Mountain stuff available. And Hera. Though I don't have fire. It's freshly dug up. So, my Thieves Town is required. It is a crystal. Uh, I mean, not Turtle Rock, excuse me. Your Turtle oh. Rock is required? Okay. Yeah, the Swamp. And Ice is my green. And... Yeah, and as, as you see, we have completely different games. Yep. Crystals are different. Everything is all messed up. So normally I don't play with a tracker, so I'm not really used to updating the, the pendants and crystals like that. <laughs> so that's my excuse for it taking like five minutes. Okay, I'm gonna go up to Death Mountain before doing the other the back half of the Smiths. Oh, time to sequence break the old man. So right now you will see that my screen is completely black. All I have is this little guiding light of a sword to tell me where I am in the room. You are not supposed to do this. Don't try this at home. Oh, dude, dark rooms are great. Navigation is, is helpful. So, there's a. Uh, this is it's called Hype Cave. It got its name because it used to be hype. Now it's kind of. Sometimes it's hype. Where's a bow? Oh, look, a bow. Exactly. Should I go do Dark Pod? <laughs> You don't even have a fire rod, do you? No, I don't. Which is the reason why I was mostly joking. <laughs> There'd be somebody out there that'd do it. Pod has a lot I of mean, items. I would do it if I had slightly more HP. So I am not going to skip this hint that's enacted. I'm just going to go get the thing. I'm gonna get these arrows and then check the hint tile. Yeah, arrows. The bottle can be found with the hobo in your world. Just in case you didn't know that. So, the Smith checks are a little less appetizing for me, uh, simply because I also don't have the hammer. I'm probably going to do them anyway, 
I also don't have Fluke to get around really easily, unlike Levon. Yeah, if Hashtag... I were you, I'd go into, like, Thieves Town. Are you, you don't have any weapon. Uh, I, I've, I've got a full magic meter and uh, Burna. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, go into Thieves Town. <laughs> That, that blinds in logic with that with that equipment. Actually, it, we're not joking either. He is. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you have a lamp, so if you have desert access, Landmo's also in logic. Oh, there you go. Oh, look, a mirror. That was that would have been very convenient, like ten seconds ago. <laughs> Sorry, that's okay. Should have checked the kid earlier. Jeez. So apparently, Paradox Cave is Heart Cave. Oh, there you go. Have, have a bottle. You can check sick kid now. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Be so, a bomb yeah, bomb. I'll, I'm probably going to put off the purple chest here for a bit. Hopefully that won't bite me. Go for it. I've dipped two. <laughs> this is a this is a pendant dungeon, so it could be a great possibility that I could just put off blind. <laughs> but with that map there, that's uh, less likely. It's a dark death mountain. I go. I forgot to check Floating Island. Oops. Almost messed up my block deletion. More health. Yeah, uh, isn't that what you're looking for? Yeah, uh, this actually won't be so bad. Uh, I I think I can do blind on one. I've never actually... I don't do Burna Blind very often. Nobody wants to do Burna Blind. Yeah, it's a, it's especially rough in like hard difficulty and later because Burna doesn't give you invincibility. Yeah. Here, we're playing on normal, so... It's, a, it's not as bad. Alright, this is... This is... The hell way. I only found one item in here, so it's a good possibility that Blind has an item at this point. Let's not put off two hints in a game. Money! Hookshot Cave was uh, a bunch of crap. So this is what I almost forgot about. So that green text means that it's just a joke. It doesn't mean anything, unfortunately. Oh. 
Welcome to Hera. Well, Hera's not fire fire locked. Our blind definitely has an item now. Now I found that compass. Okay, my so. Hera basement is nothing. I don't need to open any more of these chests in Tower of Hera. Awesome. That's nice. I already found one item. I found one item. It was 20 rupees, and there are 300 rupees waiting for me in the basement. Isn't it nice having a sword? Yeah, and a hammer. Yeah. I have two swords and a hammer. <laughs> Well, so this also means that there's another chest, the big chest in Thieves Town. I'm not going to be able to check without a hammer. Um, hint, hint. Can you send me one, please? Okay, thanks. Um, so, and we know that that has an item. I'm like I'm not getting any more items for a hot minute right now, so you're gonna have to wait because I'm gonna clear some Tower of Hera. So we'll go ahead and do blind with Berna. Pick up your badge for 2D con, yes. Are you going regardless? No, I ran out of magic. This is uh oh, no. this is bad. Problem. That is a problem. Yeah, we're done here. Like, I'm just not getting a whole lot to work with right now. <laughs> I'm trying. I can only check chests so fast. <laughs> I found my tempered sword. <laughs> Skill robbed. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh at your misfortune. I mean, I kind of do. It's, it's, it's just kind of how these work, right? How these go. Sometimes you can find all of the stuff. Let's get... That's right, out of fairy. Yeah. Into desert. Trying to get more health by. Well, I mean, like, it was successful, just not for the right reason. But I was trying to get more health. Ah. And then I had a fairy. So I got more health. I mean, <laughs> whatever works, I guess. Uh, desert. My desert is boots locked, but it's a pendant. So, yeah, I just found two items out of Skull Woods. So we're done here. There's only two items in Skull Woods, so we know that the rest of it is just trash. Um, both of the items in Desert are boots locked. Oof. Big oof. Alright, Bumper Ledge has nothing. That's a good sign.
Should I go clear swamp? Uh, are you still missing hookshot? I have hookshot. Oh, so you have everything you need to finish it? I have everything I need to, need to clear swamp. Do it. There's like six items in there. It's worth. Maybe you'll find a sword for me or something. Oh. First, I think I'm going to complete my smiths. Like, per do purple chests and hammer pegs, because I haven't done those yet, and do cave 45. Need bombs? Nope. Oh. Sure don't. They weren't for me. They were for me anyway. Huh. So I have 10 bombs. So, we'll go ahead and just do... I, I have boomerangs, so this isn't going to be so bad, but... We're going to go ahead and just do a bomb escape. At least the front half of it. You still haven't done front half escape? No. I wanted a sword first. Or a, a weapon other than bombs. But clearly the game is telling me that I need to do this. So we're going to do it. You need to and practice your bomb strats. Exactly. Oh, there. There's a weapon. I guess got my bow. I could have had that a long time ago. My God. Was it Uncle? Yeah, I had Uncle Bow. The danger uh, of putting off Sphere Zero, Sphere One locations, I guess. Yep. That in a nutshell. That's Sphere Zero, isn't it? One. Sphere Zero is technically the, um... Uh, what Link has when he starts the game. Like, oh, so, like, an OWG boots. Yeah. I'm being pedantic. Yes, you are being pedantic. Filian would be proud of you. So this also means I have a real weapon now. It actually wouldn't have helped me fight blind, but this book. Is it your book? Yeah, it's my book. I forgot to check what was on Lake Hylia Island, I think. Oops. That is relatively convenient for us, though. Well, I got my Zora money. It was in the lunchbox. In to the Swamp Palace we go. So, I'm going to go ahead, so I think my plan now is I'm going to go to Desert. And I'm going to go grab the lunchbox while I do that. Because I can go over to CAC, grab grab the, bo the box, save and quit. Without flute. It's a... Without flute's kind of a pain in the ass. Exactly. I'll have to edit that out. <laughs> That's why I just muted my microphone for a second, so I could talk. Uh...
I really should get like a foot pedal. I mean, like, I, I can mute Discord with my Stream Deck, but I still haven't figured out how to get my, the actual mic muted. I have the box right now and this will follow me through a save and quit so I'm gonna go ahead and save and quit back to my house and then we're gonna go check out desert now that I have the book you also kind of could have read what was on Bombo's tablet Yeah, I could have. Yeah, without so without without a master sword, I can't actually claim it. But yeah. a lunchbox was just a piece of heart. So this is my first look at desert. Oh, there's 50 rupees for somebody on the ledge there. And we'll go ahead and... Also, again, a favorite spot to be put off and a favorite <laughs> place to, to find progression as well. Yep. It's kind of a one-off location until you get desert access. Yep. $50. Or fluid. Yeah. Then it's not so bad. No. Hey, look. Boots. And Bombos. Ooh, I get to see if I can pull off Zero Cycle Argus. And a Fire Rod. Well, well then. There is a chance if there is an item on Argus that I don't need to do left side swamp. Either way though, swamp was a great play. found a small key in that chest, so we can continue. Silver arrows, landmo. This, this, that's all the only weapon you got against him. <laughs> that would be, that would be slightly amazing. I can't lie. Oh, it's a big key. That means I have to go back in. Dang it. So I did find the big key to desert. So that's a good sign. That means, well, that means there's an either an item or or a map or compass on the torch. We'll find that out here in just a second. We haven't actually found any real items in here, I think. Or one maybe. Wrong door. Wrong door. What is this, amateur hour? Yeah, basically. Okay, that's fair. The boots can be found in Turtle Rock and player. Ah, yeah, my boots in TR. It's, uh, I have it's... no axe. I am currently a, a cane and a ether away from TR. Ah, oh, I found my flute. That's a. Uh... That's good. We'll we'll come back to Landmo in just a second. 
So, I saved and quit it out of there because I just want to activate this flute. And I can come back there really easily with the gear I have. Since I have Mirror and Titan's Mitts. Seven. Boo. Bad memes. Yeah. But memes regardless. So we're going to just come back over here now. And we have a few more checks that we can do. We're going to figure out what the medallion requirement for Misery Mire is. Well, Swamp was, was was not a bust. That is for damn sure. Right. I'm gonna go check what's on Pylia Island. So, Misery Mire is Bombos. There's your silvers. Oh, awesome. And my hammer! Well... That's nice to know. I'll take it. Okay, I'm gonna go do Skull Woods and then North Dark World. <laughs> now that you have things to do. Spin speed. Ah, I missed yeah. spin speed. I have. <laughs> <laughs> it's a sword. Is it mine or yours? It's mine. I, it's yours. Yes. I don't need another sword. Tempered sword, silvers, like, this is already the easiest in the world. So, I am loaded for bear. I have a weapon now. So, so the, as things stand, do you need your boots? Not right now, no. Okay, everything that... Okay, well, I'll still... If it is convenient to do so, I will acquire your boots. Yeah, if you're if you're forced to go in there, yeah, do it. But well, you even can... if not, if I'm forced to go in there, if I'm up like, if I get access to it, I'll go get your boots. Oh, it depends on how deep it makes... is. Do you know yeah. what makes this game better? Having the boots. It does. Well, we're close to a one cycle. Oh, for a uh, landmo? Yeah, two cycle landmo with silvers, though. But... So I now have my first crystal of the game. I have two. Yeah. You see, like, giving you, like, a lot of stuff to, like, enter dungeons, but it's not finish. At least for me. So, I have everything I need to do uh, pods. So that's exactly what I'm going to do right now. If I flew to the right location. You want five, not four. Ah, shoot. There's... I goofed up my powder. 
there's also a so in the dark world there's actually also a storyteller here that will have a hint i'm going to make up for my previous transgression of skipping that other hint by we'll go for this one it's cost uh, the lobo price of 20 rupees this guy will will tell you something he'll just tell me to walk away which is exactly what i'm gonna do right now <laughs> thanks Come on, Mothula, get your tail down where I can hit you. So, this isn't too bad, right? Like, I can go back in and finish Pod, Eastern, yeah. Eastern, yeah. Too bad. yeah. I know that this is, uh, they're both crystals, so. In multi worlds, like, the more players you have in your game, the more likely you're gonna have to, like, dip all the dungeons anyway, or double dip them. So. Yeah, I've been lucky. I haven't really had to double dip anything, yeah. except for desert, technically, but I don't even know if I need to do that. Because I have gotten zero items out of there, and I can get zero items out of there right now. I have an item on blind that I can get, and the big chest, <laughs> now that I got the hammer. Those are two items. So I have some orphan locations I need to keep track of. Fortunately, if you're playing this like at home, right, there's a slash missing command in the client, which is pretty awesome. Uh, if we're bad, we may have to use it here, but I think we can keep our our checks. I don't think we'll straight. have to use it. Yeah. Oh, that's too close. Come on. I know how to bomb jump. I swear. Let's not just keep falling into the pit. One item. We're being required. Hey, I found my lamp. Nice. Yeah. Lamp's always nice. Well, dark rooms are like dark rooms are great to learn though. They are very useful. Yeah. Okay, so now we go check this. We still have not found your ice rod. Uh, correct. And see, I've been without a sword so for so long I'm forgetting I have one. <laughs> it happens. So I was talking about earlier about bombs and dropping them and throwing them and get receiving an item while trying to do that. That's what happened there. So <laughs> is the thing. So I'm gonna go knock out uh, Catfish and Zora. And then go into Pawn Eastern. That's my game plan from here. I think it makes make more sense to do that in the other order, do Pawn Eastern and then go to Catfish. Look, red mail. Well, more money. All of the money. So I'm finding a lot of keys, right? So I have five keys I found. 
Uh, six. I think I found all six, yeah. So... What we'll go ahead and do... Yeah, pod key logic can be quite a thing to figure out. It's probably the most complex dungeon key wise. That's probably true. What all do you need before you're in go mode? Well, I found one piece of it. That was the hook shot. Uh, that was in the big chest. Um, I need some Maria, my uh, rods. Um, I know I definitely need Bombos, and I'm about ready to go and figure out what other medallion I need for Turtle Rock. Okay. Well, I am currently just... Quake and Samaria. Assuming I properly marked. I don't think I properly marked my crystals. So, I'll find out here in just a second. <laughs> I stared at that map for like a whole five minutes. Oh no, yeah, I so I did it correctly. Yeah. So Yeah, so I definitely will need bombos. Have some powder. The Take best it. safety in the game. There's no sarcasm there. It actually is a really nice safety to have. It, it's the only one I still get when I'm running an MG. When I'm like running the vanilla game, it's the only safety I still get. Also, technically need Master Sword. That'd be nice too. Now that's one of those things. We'll find that. That'll show up. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, I need the Gold Sword. I don't have that yet. Clearly required to beat the game. It's a nice uh, turtle room. I'll take that. So, this guy is Helmosaur King. I'm gonna go ahead and hammer out my differences with him. You don't wanna bomb him? Nah, I need to save my bombs. I had an Enemizer seed once where, I, where it was required that you bombed. Yeah, that can happen. <laughs> All right. So that's uh, my second crystal now. I'm about ready to claim my third. I'm about to go claim my fifth. was a 
really crappy statue. Stalfos room. <laughs> yeah, I was just that. See, that's how you don't do Stalfos room. Says a reference. At least my menuing is on point. I'm kind of happy with that. Hey, that meme came from Blank Park Zoo, which is right where I live. Actually, if I would have went in that room without farming arrows, I wouldn't have had enough. With silvers. <laughs> I only had five arrows. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's go check Sphere, sphere 1 locations now. <laughs> At hour 7. Yeah. Shoot, I didn't realize, I didn't realize that was an item. Walk back in. It was not an item. I'm glad I went back in. There is an item at the vanilla big chest. The vanilla big key chest. That's an item location I almost always skip. In the pod. So. Yeah, I'm going to Death Mountain. Because with that hook shot, that opens up a whole bunch of stuff. Well, three more checks, I should say. Hey, look, my red came. I'm glad I went back into pod to check to see if I got an item off the top of the sword. Plus, yeah, this is my first, uh, it's my first trip to East Death Mountain. <laughs> so, there's probably a whole lot of value in here. It's like this is my first trip into Eastern Palace, your point? <laughs> I also haven't done Sahasrila yet. <laughs> Because I completely and totally forgot to go do Sahasrala. That's one. Look at all this junk. We'll go collect even more trash. Oh, there's my Bombos medallion. Not what I wanted to see right now. <laughs> well, kind of. I needed it eventually. There's my flippers. All right. There's some value there. Now we're going to go to the Dark World and check the rest of this. I love that block clip. <laughs> it feels he, great. Yeah, he knows which one I'm talking about. He may not even be watching my stream. 
I'm not. I know exactly <laughs> which one you're talking about. The first one is whatever. It's the second one that feels good. Yeah. Now, for Lucky, uh, our requirement for our requirement for Turtle Rock is Bombos, but it is either. my first shield of the game. Thanks. Thanks for that. Well, we'll keep the memes out of that one. Yep. And I actually forgot, because I'm bad, I forgot to check uh, Floaty Island. So we're going to go do blind. <laughs> well, no, I couldn't have checked it because of the way I routed it. I'd have had to mirror. Oh well. It may be something. I'll find out. I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna go get this blue or red pendant. Just in case. There's not an item on the boss, but I'm gonna go get the pendant anyway. While I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and read this tablet. Like I said before, we need to have the Master Sword in order to actually get this item, but at least we'll know. We'll have some intel. Okay, Eastern <laughs> done. I now have five crystals and one pendant. All right. Hey, I know where your gold sword's at. I don't need it. <laughs> is it on the tablet? It is on the either tablet. Yeah, gold sword is of like the value on gold sword isn't that bad so it's it's mostly to see it on bosses ganon is a little faster with it hey did you, you still... remember to check the hospital's hut yeah okay because i just did <laughs> hour 13 let's go check the sphere one locations see that's really easy to do also in a multi-world more so than just playing a normal randomizer because like you can get like a lot of good stuff from other players and just just want to dive deeper into the spheres yep that's what i did i mean i had dark world access at five minutes yep i mean thinking about it that could also happen in a normal randomizer it could, it's less likely. Yeah. So there's crystal number four. And you know what, I'm feeling like going and actually, let's go check that hint since I'm here. The one I've forsaken. Well, let's be smart, let's be smart. I'm at Hyrule Castle. You know what I should do while I'm at Hyrule Castle? Check the sewers chest. That'd be a good call. Well, I'm at... I'm not at Hyrule Castle. I'm at, I was at Ganon's Tower. Or at, um... Ganon's yeah. Tower. Pyramid. That's the thing. Ganon's resting place. You know, skipping that hint was actually a good call. That bomb jump is really cool when you get it. It's a little precise, though. Which one? Getting back across from... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Spec Rock. Yeah. Oh, Spec Rock. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, there you go, have a heart. I'm gonna go do the thing. I don't want to. I'm gonna go spend five minutes for one item location. But it has an ice rod, and we need at least one ice rod, and we don't know where yours is yet, so I'm gonna guess. Spike cave? They call it spike no. cave because of spikes. Oh, uh, no, I'm going up Aghanim's tower. So I'm running out of good plays to make, so I'm starting to have to do more lower percentage plays. Or I mean, starting to dive into pendants, so... This isn't really a good play that I'm making, it's a play. It's probably yeah. a necessary one, so... To be honest, I should probably dive into Swamp. I got all the gear for it. There's six checks. You should, you should dive Swamp. Yeah. It's a pendant, but it's... We can also get intel on the Bombos tablet while we're at it. But we'll go ahead and do hammer pegs and uh, bat cave. Oh, alright, I found my single arrow. There's only... There's only one single arrow in each item pool, and I found both of them. <laughs> How many blue balls am I going to get today? Agronym is luck. Is good. Am I going to be lucky? Probably not. I'm never lucky. I also have my mushroom turn in. That might be a good call. More cash! <laughs> I have so much cash. So far we have one. There's two blue balls. So every time Agadim does an attack, he is cycled. The first one is always reflectable. After that, it's a 50-50 chance for them to be reflectable or not. That's three. And then he shoots lightning, and then it rinses and it repeats. I just found my master sword. Four. That'll... That'll make Swamp a little smoother, finding that. Is, uh... Is Aggro 1 treating you well? I'm at four above average, wow. but... Alright, getting worse. We're at a third of a Screevo. Five. <laughs> there's a, there's a... one is now dead. So, there's like a... There's like a... I wouldn't call it like a meme, but it's more like a, a nickname for getting 15 blue balls. Which, which is, is the max you can get. Which is the full Screevo. Up. Yeah, unless you screw up, yeah. You screw it's called up, the... you can get more than 15. Yeah. It's called the full Screevo. Because it happened to Screevo he twice. The, he is the only person to have gotten a recorded 15 blue balls. And he's done it twice. 
This tells you how much he plays. It's a lot of runs. But he doesn't really play that much. Really? Oh. No. <laughs> That's why it's so funny. Oh. There you go. Like, he does maybe one or two runs a week. I sent even more money to you, by the way. I saw that. I'm about to go spend a bunch of it, so thanks. I, I think that's all four of your 300 drops. Unless there was a... I know I've sent you three of them so far. That I remember. Hey, look. Least. Quake. I'm in go mode. Screw you, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> such a, such an excellent multi-rolled partner there. Yep, I know. I can finish the game. This is a race now, right? <laughs> now, the real question is, is that Ice Rod Miner yours? I mean, I'm going to go get it. <laughs> yeah. I'm honestly going to go get it. I'm going to go get it, and then I'm going to go clear Ice Palace, and I'm going to go clear Mire. Then I'm going to do Fat Fairy, and then I'm going to go do Ganon's Tower. <laughs> Yeah, that's the thing about multi worlds is that you're you're not done until everybody's done. You're getting, I mean, I could well, be done. You could. I, I could say I'm done, and then ha 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 ha. You you never get to finish. It's the story of my sex life right there. <laughs> <laughs> well. That lovely pendant dungeon music. Now I'll go ahead and do all this and then watch as okay. my last two, two, I need two items out of Thieves Town or something that I skipped. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here we are. The moment of truth. Damn it. <laughs> Is it oh yours? Yeah. Oh my. Ugh. Alright, well. I can't even access T Rock yet, so. Uh, I need my some. I need some Mario still as well. Go get all the items out of the desert. And then go to Meyer. We both knew in in our heart of hearts that it was my ice rod. <laughs> yeah, there, there's always that that small chance, right? Well, it's like I won't say it's fifty fifty. That would be. I mean, that probably is not accurate, but close. I mean, it's probably close to fifty fifty. I mean, like if you want to see the Monty Hall problem in action, just play a randomizer. Oh, you were asking really about my 2D con ticket. Yeah, I'm gonna buy that really soon. Okay. I, I, pl I plan on going. I already booked yeah, the room. Yeah, I plan on going regardless. So. I got the time off. Well, on Friday afternoon. I'll probably just drive up early or later that day. Depends on when the know. if the run gets accepted. Anyway, go ahead. Yeah, like I'm off Friday. I currently have to work Sunday. I'll see if I can find somebody to cover for me. But mm. Sundays are hard for me to get off. Does everybody else want some off? It. A lot of people don't have Sundays off at my work. So. Oh. That, true. Short hops. I 
don't want to talk about this land model. <laughs> I hit the first two and then missed the third one twice. Okay, desert completed. Hey, I have the green pendant now. I could go turn it into Sahasra. <sighs> I'll probably go do that when I do Pyramid Fairy. So far, we haven't hit encountered BK. It's a... No, I, I don't think we will. Yeah, this is fairly... Because you have... You still have a lot of stuff you can do, right? Yeah. I'm in go, so... It's a pretty tame seed. Yeah. There's my Samaria. And a big key. We'll go check that out. So there's a little glitch here, right? If you go up these stairs... The game just gets confused where you are, and it'll just walk you back down. And then, uh, you just go back uh, up yes. again. The stairs. Is that like vanilla behavior? Yes, that happens in the vanilla game as well. They figured that. You're... Sorry, you're, you, I don't think you're ever really supposed to go up those stairs. They just never tested it, huh? Or maybe they did. Like, it's a it's a it's a JP 1.0 exclusive. So. I don't. Uh, at least I think so. I don't think it does that in the English game. That'd be an easy one to discover later and fix. Yeah. You don't have a whole lot of rights to co to complain about the bugs in this game because we play a game that's into that. We know is bugged. Yep. This game is, is broken. So it got broken so so much more recently too. Yeah. Oh. Has there been anything new since then? Uh, after. Since like GDQ. Yeah. After Pincus discovered that eight that arbitrary code execution. Uh. I don't know. I don't think a whole lot. I think that's pretty much like I think the extent of the Insula uh, glitches. Yeah. The odds are pretty much all of it's going to not be race legal anyway. There was a recent, uh, there's a skip for uh, the big key in Hera. Uh, it requires uh, a hook shot bombs and the boots make it easier to set up I was trying to do it last night it's a uh, it's a little tricky there's a there's a there's a short video of it in the randomizer discord <laughs> so I found Samaria which is a good sign that's that's good I could finish mm -hmm. uh, Meyer, which I'm going to go into right now. That's where I am. Yeah. I still need uh, fire my rods, though. So. Both of them? Oh, man. Yeah. I also have full health coming into here, which is nice. It'll make the whiz robe room a little yeah, sword. easier to deal with. Yeah. Also, having master sword is also nice before the sword beams. Oh, well, that's both the items out of here. Okay. 
forgot to set up, set up Spooky. Oh well. I should learn Spooky. I just realized I accidentally got my shield eaten by a leg leg. <laughs> Maybe I'll send you another one then won't be so bad. I don't need the shield. It was just a fire shield. Doesn't actually block much. Well, the good news is I found. The good news is I found the big key quick. It was a godmire. The bad news is I'm not go mowing it. <laughs> Oops, that is the dungeon map. Did you know what the inst did you know what Meyer looks like? Just in case you forgot, I could have showed you. I showed you for a brief second the layout of Meyer was. There's item two. That's good. We can go ahead and just finish this dungeon now. We don't need any small keys or anything like that. We'll just finish her up. Just get her done. Exactly. That was actually not a bad mire. <laughs> it's a. Uh, I got silvers for vitreous. So this will be pretty simple. That's why I needed Samaria. Wait, where am I going? Let's not loot to the wrong place. I want to loot to house. You know, I knew there was nothing in right side, in left side swamp. And I did it anyway, because I forgot. I got a hint about that earlier. I'm looking forward to playing without hints again. Though in, in large multi-worlds, hints are pretty great. Uh, yeah, hints are great in large multi-worlds. Yeah. A lot of it also is kind of... It kind of gives you reason to talk to other players a little bit more. Which is always nice. Yeah. I think against Sins is more competitive, but. The one cycle? Yes. That's easy, though, with silvers. Yeah, one cycle is super, is free with silvers. It's our, our small key on Vitreous, a classic. Hey, mine too. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you on? You fighting Vitreous too? I I killed Vitreous. Right here, you go. Have a shovel and a bug den. So it's crystal number five. I have six currently. I orphaned two items in Thieves Town, so I'm gonna go ahead and check that. Your Thieves was a pendant, right? Yeah. Can you clear any crystals? No. Skull Woods and TR are my last. I need a Fire Rod for Skull Woods. I've already done what I can. And I found both items. Like, pretty quick. Well, into Ice Palace I go. Yeah, I'm gonna probably dive into ice as well here. Like, literally all I have to do is Ice Palace. 
I can do Spike Cave and GT. I can't even get into Turtle Rock. Because I don't have either. Yeah, uh, my... I wonder where my Ether Medallion is at. It's probably... It's probably in Thieves Town or... Ice. Or it could be on Pedestal. <laughs> I had not checked Ped yet. So... I still don't have a book, so... Yeah. You might be looking at a blind Ped pool. Unless I get Fire Rod. Then I'll go couple in... What am I doing? I don't know. What are you doing? It's a good question. I'm. I just needed to hit the switch. There's nothing in the ice palace big chest. I know that because of him. There's one thing you should know about Sinak is he loves his. He just loves autopiloting. Except for when I get hit with an item. God damn it. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> I'm trying to do the Stalpos quick kill. <laughs> which is not <laughs> helpful when my bomb keeps exploding. Hey, just let me know if you don't want to receive items and I'll... <laughs> I can... I can... I can sit here. So... You gotta do blind. The script is, uh, it's not gonna be a thing here. But I've got, like, red nail and, like, 15 hearts. Yeah, if you can't do blind with red nail, 15 hearts, and don't you have half magic, too? I'm actually missing that. Mine's in Ganon's, mine's in Ganon's tower. That's where mine is. Okay. Not that I need. Well, that was a bust. A bust. Yeah. Unless Ped has something. Man, there's something good on my pedestal. I just feel it now. But we'll, uh. It's probably my ether medallion. Just, to... Well, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go into Ice Palace right now. Uh, oh, and right. do my wa Oh, and my water checks. Oh, I haven't done water checks yet. <laughs> uh, oh, hour 40 Zora. <laughs> yeah, basically. Why did well, I agree to do this with you? Jeez. <laughs> well, no, so... I last location... So, at GDQ, right? We did our first multi-world of GDQ. We did the first one of GDQ. Yeah. And, uh, he goes in, uh, I last location his, uh, ice, his, uh, hook shot. He ended up having Mentos Man hover Moldorm yeah. 2 for him. Yep. Was it Catfish, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. I just kind of, no. that's another check that hasn't happened yet. You are not very thorough with your checks, sir. No, I'm not. <laughs> hey, it, sometimes it wins you races, sometimes it, uh, burns you horrendously. Usually the <laughs> latter. Usually. Such an out of the way check. I also haven't checked pyramid either. Uh, I might just want to do. You know what? That might just be a good idea. Those are bust. All right. Oh, waterfall didn't have anything. World's worst multi-world partner, right here. Yep. Eh. We'll get our run rejected. It's like, guys. <laughs> so fifty dollars on Zora Ledge. 
Let's see what Zora has. We'll do pyram we'll I'll do pyramid and then I think I have by five and sixes as well, so I can go and do Yeah, I can do Pyramid Fairy as well and all that. So we'll go do that. And then we'll do ice. You'll probably be entering ice as I'm leaving. Assuming I don't die to cold stare. It's a good thing I have bombos, because otherwise I wouldn't have enough magic. <laughs> Actually, this kind of works out. Like, yeah, I'll, I'll have three checks on the pyramid with this bomb. And then we'll do catfish. Pul calculated. Uh huh. That was a messy cold stare. Like, really messy. Well, you I'm survive going at least. GT. Yeah. Actually, should I do Spike Cave before I go up to GT? <laughs> That's literally all I have mm, left. I do GT. Spike. I'm gonna do Spike Cave. Here's my fire rod. <laughs> Maybe I won't do GT. You have stuff to do now. You know something? You can't yeah. save and quit into the light world when you have killed. Yeah. Heck of one. So Skullwoods really doesn't. So that fire rod really doesn't unlock anything for me, actually. Bits of T Rock. Still need either medallion. Oh, you don't have your medallion? Yeah. So I'm still diving ice. Because I have both items out of Skullwoods. Makes sense. Okay, Spike Cave I go, and then to GT. It will make Ice Palace easier, though, that Fire Rod, which is nice. Hey, I got a heart refill at Spike Cave. <laughs> oh, I forgot how annoying Spike Cave is when you have already killed the one. <laughs> Spike Cave is in the Dark World. Alright. We'll just stock up on some blue potions. It's always good before going into this dungeon. Even though you have... I have like 15 hearts in red mail. It's not that bad. But... With fluid, it makes that really simple. <laughs> nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Some armor can be found in your uncle and player one's world. Thanks, man. Yeah, block clip. Love that block clip so much.
Sorry, I can't go get your boots. I would if I could. That's fine. number 12 for my big key. I'll do 11. It's not one. Candy is dandy, but liquor is quicker. It's not two. Not three, that was my blue king. There's your ether. Uh, four. Not four. You needed ether, right? Yeah? Yeah, I needed it. There you go. Now you have it. I can. I can now begin. Can... Yeah. You should do ice first. Yeah. I mean, unless that ice rod shows up, then I'm out of here because I'll be go. Yeah. Well, that's not six. I also bomb jumped, but that was actually a bad idea. It's habit. Yeah. I also bomb jumped when I didn't need to bomb jump, so. There's my ice rod. All right, I'm out of here. You're, you're out of here? Okay. I'm I out. My big, key. big key was seven. You're you're in go mode? Yes. I am out of here. Up we go. That was... That was a pretty dumb placement for that. <laughs> hey, you know what? Hour 48 go mode for a two-player multi-world is not bad. Actually. Yeah. Actually, first we need to do Skull Woods. Yeah, go do Skull Woods and go do T-Rock. Yep. I, Come on. We'll just, we won't know it's on the tide until the end of the game. That was a really bad mimic. Holy cow. I will. Climb the tower. And since I got really lucky with my item drops or my chests in here, I don't have a small key, so I need to remember to grab this <laughs> or else bad things will happen. Well, not terrible, but we'll, we'll I be wasting be time. Pain. There would be just a small amount of pain. I'd laugh at you. Yeah, I'd laugh at me too. Alright. So, this is called being out of magic because you're wasteful. But the good news is that I do have. There we go. I made up for my crappy Lanmo 1 fight with a solid Lanmo 2 fight. So, we're gonna, we're gonna have a donation incentive here. Um. The donation incentive is going to be, do I use the B on uh, Mothula? If you get like $10 have, right now, I'll do it. Like we'll, You can't we'll have a donation incentive for that, because you don't know if you're going to have a B when you get to Mothula. Yeah, probably. I'll catch one. And then I'll have to, so Bugnet would then be required... Go ahead and we'll release the B here.
to be honest, B makes it slower. It really does. So, yeah. Off you're, on, you're on Master Sword, right? Yeah. So I'll check these chests that are on the way. Yeah, it'd be nice. I got silver, so it's not the end of the world, but... <laughs> I mean, the checks are literally right there. Yeah. Alright, so there's Skull Woods. What should we set the estimate to on this? Um, I would set it to probably 220, 215. I think it's probably a fair estimate. Add another 15 minutes for keys, maybe half an hour for keys. Half hour for keys extra would probably be good. Like I'm a TR and... A GT away, which will probably be about 205. And this yeah. was kind of a slow seed. Like, it started out really fast, and then we bottlenecked. And I am bad at geometry. Like, seriously. One, one. Yeah. One, one, two. <laughs> Okay, one, one, two, two, eh, four cycle. <laughs> this means, like, there is a chance you may have to go into TR for boots. <laughs> there's, there's that one out of oh. whatever. Oh, well, we would have a problem. I didn't even think of that. I can't. I still can't go into T-Rock. <laughs> I can't go into my T-Rock. Which means... I can use GD glitches to get there, but... Ah. Uh, so, I did leave a couple items. I left three items. Two items behind in ice. Plus, it's a Hasrula. Any of those could have had it. It's more likely that it's probably in GT or my GT or something. If, if we needed it. We'll see soon enough, I suppose. The one in 22? Yeah. So we're not quite go mode. This is like a... A, Sh a Schrodinger's go mode? I think that's the, the meme there. Yeah, I think that's the meme. Not... I don't... I wouldn't call it accurate, but... Ugh. <sighs> I didn't even think about that. Yeah, that's... <laughs> like, so I'm currently fighting Ganon, so... We'll know, we'll know here in a little bit. If you have to go back into your game, so be it. Yep. That's right, you're trying to fight Ganon. <laughs> <laughs> you messed up my triple. That was rude. <laughs> I had the perfect setup for a triple. <laughs> Oops. Ah, so rude. Okay. Done. GG. Oh, that's nifty. The it just like gives you the post like the post game collection rate the second you walk through the door to try for it. I didn't know that before. Does? Yeah, with auto tracking. Oh. Emo tracker did. Okay. It's like the client also gives you that. Like that was one forty eight to two sixteen. Hmm. For me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Are you using the built-in multi-client then, the emo tracker? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I suppose I probably shouldn't skip Lava Chest. <laughs> Probably nothing. Oh, no, I couldn't skip it. I had my big key. <laughs> well, I'm being bad. It's calculated. Suppose I should probably check Mimic Cave as well, just to make sure it's not boots. Is that. That wouldn't be fun to come back to. No. But yeah. by the way, I'm, I'm also a, ba a bad multi-world partner. I'll fix that. <laughs> Couldn't even chat in your channel before. Oh, there's my Quake Medallion. That doesn't really help me much, but... There's that. Yeah, the logic chain in the end was a bit messy. Just a little bit. Just, that's kind of how these kind of work out, though. Mm-hmm. I totally forgot you don't have the boots. Oh, don't worry. I, I didn't forget. Really? Oh my gosh. Do you know what's on my pedestal? No. A sword for you. Can, could you? <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. Oh, that's right. I don't have either. <laughs> I literally can't. I do not have the ability. Yeah, this seed was the worst. Well, not the worst. I mean, being three hours into a seed without Loom Pearl is the worst. Poor Mentos, man. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, not poor. He was having a good time because he was just like oh, super yeah, funny all over the place. Breaking everything, but, yeah. Yeah. That's like, well. It's about half magic. Do some bootlets, uh, uh, bootsless laser skips here. Ew. No, I wouldn't call those laser skips. Those are laser tanks. <laughs> Laser tanks, yeah. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> so you know how you do a laser skip? That's how you do a laser skip. Here's my key. 
That's a that's a pro grade laser. That's a bootless laser scope. Right there. Shout out to that vanilla small key, by the way. Yep. All right. Now for my arch. Hey, look, hammer trinex. Hammer trinex. Oh, that did not. Yeah, I mean, I totally didn't get burned by this during my race against JC. The... No. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in me too. What? Is that not a, re a hit? <laughs> I don't know if you can do it anymore. Oh, come on. First sword, three minutes. Pegasus boots, 46 minutes. Flute, three minutes. Mirror, 30 minutes. Killed zero bosses swordless, zero bosses with fighter sword, two bosses with master, ten with tempered, and zero with gold. My GT big key was six because of my funky route through GT. Alright. Zero deaths, zero fairy revivals, so I'm actually feel pretty good about that. One sixty two out of two sixty. Hammer hitbox is the worst. So All right, where's my big key? Um Four. Five. Oh, you had to be one different for me, huh? Ink. Nah, it's probably in tile room or something dumb like that. It better not be on the goddamn torch. All right, oh, we'll go three. So three. Three. Let's do no, it. The torch is number one. Oh. You do GT wrong. <laughs> torch is one. <laughs> Always check. No, I don't touch whole room. Come on, Lionel. Alright. <laughs> Didn't you know you can't slash Lionel's with the Master Sword? It doesn't do anything. Yeah. No, I, I know. I was just waiting for him. He's not scared of this sword. Like, I'm not sure how to reload into my game. I've never actually tried to load back into a randomizer after finishing it. <laughs> just reset. Oh, uh, just reset the... Just reset the console. Yeah, okay. All right. Good news is we don't need those boots. Okay, good. I don't need to deal with anything else. I'm going to cut nope. my stream out. Or do you want me to keep mine active? No, we're good. I'll, uh... On the edit... When I edit this together, I'll just watch as it's some frickin'. See, I'm following your advice here. I'm not doing hope chest. It's yeah, gonna burn. Right. Well, three keys in Dark Magician. <laughs> full left, right, full left side first is, is the best way to do it. That is the correct way to do Ganon's Tower. Uh, forever's watching this, that's a matter of opinion and not fact. <laughs> and please not take fact. it. Please uh, do it accordingly. <laughs> Gotta do this all the slow way.
What is that, VGM? I showed somebody this. Oh, wait. That's right. I don't have boots. Oh. <laughs> I oh, showed the some... The, the bonk that. Yeah. It's like, ah, oh, it's cool. The small things, right? There's a couple. There's a few bonks here. Like, I'm gonna have to go and... I'm gonna have to bomb jump a few things. Where's your book? <laughs> Maybe it's on one of your tablets. Maybe it's on your pedestal. No, your sword is on my pedestal. Oh, that's right. Maybe it's... Maybe it's on one of your tablets. Ah. Oh. We'll never know now. That was bad. right there if this isn't hope chest I'm gonna be very mad Perfect. Well, we're good now. Nope, oh, sword. Sword get. Sword. Sword so, get. See, see, even if it's in the hope room, it was worth it because you have the sword now. Oh, I could have done Master Sword. Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> it's hey, you know what? Uh, it's never... In, dude, it's never in Hope Room. It's like my first check. I would, I would have, been, I would have been stuck with Master Sword, which isn't the worst. I'm happy with those mimic rooms, at least. <laughs> One of these days, we'll figure out where either medallion's at. <laughs> I will never know. Bet you it's on my pedestal. It's probably, probably on my vanilla. I'll have to look at the multi data file. Because now I'm slightly curious. Die in GT. No. 
Don't die. <laughs> this friend is still getting rejected now. Why did you die? Why did you die? You had a potion. No, I didn't. Oh, did you used your potion? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. If I had boots, I'd have been fine. They're... Walking. And we're walking. Can't even access safety room. <laughs> you could bomb jump over to it, I think. I wonder if you can bomb jump over the safety room. You could. Maybe, yeah. I think you could. See, that's how that that's how I'm supposed to do that room. Makes it so hard to like lack of boots. Like you really feel it throughout the course of a run. Yes, you do. That'd be pretty cool. At least I did that room right. <laughs> Those rooms are so satisfying. It's not satisfying is not having boots right now. <laughs> you don't need to keep bringing it up, man. I get it. <laughs> You're mad at me for not going to places that I can't go to find your boots. I like playing with fire. In multiple ways. Like if you go up that, if you go up to that floor on the same frame. Don't despawn the tower. Yeah, I did that at GDQ. All right, so clearly. Just out of curiosity what all that was. <laughs> and then... We'll, uh... Forget to switch the hook shot. That's what we'll do. This 
seems a little suboptimal. Just a little bit. Guess we'll just never know where your either medallion was at. Somewhere. Inside Turtle Rock. I guess I don't have to worry about items not being sent to me. Yep. <laughs> We're good there. Sub 220. Yeah. That's what I figure, like... Actually, maybe 230 would probably be a good estimate. Yeah. Alright, I'm done. I <laughs> stole for the fourth triangle. <laughs> Alright. to go anyway that's uh that's that's Bonta's multi-world for the Legend of Zelda Link to the Past randomizer it's a it's a fun one to play um, if you're interested in checking it out more uh, you can go to discord.gg slash alttp randomizer that'll get us on the that'll get you on our discord and then there's a multi-world planning channel that has a pinned message that has a link to the guide to get set up on it if you want to try it out for yourself uh, if this run gets accepted you probably won't need trackers we're going to use auto trackers like we just did here the only thing we would need to do is mark our pendants and crystals at least what they were um, otherwise you could just incorporate the uh, the auto tracker onto your stream uh, pretty easily just include it as a as a, a window is a window yeah um 
because like I will be running off of a laptop on emulator because I don't have an SD this mess. Hey, if you want to borrow one, I eh. I'm used to playing on emulator. That's 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 fair. <laughs> This person slasher. I think the the quality of the video is kind of I I got a retro tank. I think that's helped a bit with the video quality. It's not as good as if um because I was doing like RGB, but the retro tank does a lot better job of of getting a nice four, 480p signal. But then my computer, then this upscales. <laughs> Maybe I'll stop buying capture equipment now. <laughs> no, it's not going to happen. I'm going to continue buying capture equipment. Is it possible to have enough capture equipment? I don't know. I've got like two analog capture devices. i got my Elgato. Now the retro tank for, for doing the... The conversion from from interlaced 240 to the 480p. I think it doesn't I don't have any capture devices. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes the uh, multi worlds are a bit closer than this one. This one's, there was a decent difference between Levon and I, mostly just because of all the stuff you found early. So yeah. I was doing like a lot of really early one-off well, stuff. You, you, had, you had to do a lot of backtracking. Yeah. That that Levon avoided. So that that's kind of where a lot of the time discrepancy comes from. Otherwise, it was a. Pr I think it was a pretty fun seed. Yeah, I enjoyed kind it. of, kind of showed off, kind of what just a two-player multi-world is like. I have somebody hosting me. Might be me. I'm DJ sure. Fatso. Mm, I, I don't know who that is either, but they're hosting me, which is interesting, because. <laughs> Like, nobody watches my channel. Nobody watches my channel either. Yeah. I noticed that nobody watches your channel. You don't even have an affiliate. Nope. I probably never will either. Even though, I know affiliate's a low bar, but... It's a really low bar. But I just don't invest enough time in my streaming to... Even get enough viewers for that. It's like you need, like, what, an average of three viewers... Over yeah, 30 days or something like that. Yep. But I have two right now. It's like myself and probably you. <laughs> I am looking forward to 2D Con though. I'm gonna try to get one of my. I'm gonna try to get my friend, uh, to go to it. He'll probably he'll probably take the room on Saturday night, so if you can't make it Sunday and you just have the room Friday night, that kinda works out then. Okay. It kinda it'll depend actually, I think a lot on like if the if this run gets accepted when it's gonna be played when we're gonna do it. Yep. Oh, there's some names there. These are really cool people. You should check them out. Even though Chris Owen is now Chris Owen and Carcat is now Cat Devs Games. But yeah. Oh, Chris just changed his his handle yeah. too. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, we got a Carcat is now Cat Devs Games. Yeah. 
You kind of drop the TOS part. It's, it's RB89. Some sprite All of devs. The yeah. Scudge. Game's weird, man. Game's yeah. weird. I love the fact that Sakura is like front and center. What are my... Guess how many bonks I have. Zero. Yeah. That's a good intuition there. Guess uh, what time I got my Pegasus boots. You, you didn't. Guess, guess what time I got my mirror. <laughs> yeah. That was literally the first thing you found, wasn't it? Yep. Four fighter sword kills. Five master. Two tempered. 17 out of 22. That would have been two. <laughs> oh well. That menu time was disgusting though. Yeah, my menu time was pretty good. Yeah. Alright. I guess that concludes this. I'll go ahead and stop recording and all that. Uh, thanks for for whoever's reviewing this, thanks for watching. I hope you consider our run, and we think that it'll be a pretty entertaining time. That's the hope, at least. Yep.